Joe and two weather, Kamaka Pili. It's the final Aloha Friday of the year, and it's going to be a great one across the islands, no matter what island you're, you're situated on. But if we highlight Hilo on the island of, of Hawaii, partly cloudy skies, especially during the afternoon hours and those wind speeds pretty much prevailing across the state. We're seeing on the lighter side of the spectrum, 5 up to 15 miles per hour. Good news, tomorrow we'll have a little brief period of trade winds, only to lose them once more and be more of a southeasterly flow as we get into the weekend. For our threats for tomorrow, it's really just a high surf advisory from the north and west facing shores of Kauai to Molokai, north shores of Maui and the west shores of Hawaii Island. That's in effect until Saturday morning at 6 o'clock. We have this current northwest swell that's been filling in since yesterday. 15 to 20 footers up north, 12 to 16 for the west and 1 to 3 calmest and coolest conditions on the south and the east facing shores. But heads up because as we get into our New Year's Day by Sunday evening, a larger swell and a longer period swell should be filling in, bringing potentially high surf warning levels as we get into the new year, so surfers keep that in mind. What's taking place around the islands has been pretty much the same as we've been speaking throughout the, this whole week. This next cold front that's north of the islands, that will dissipate and it won't be really bringing any showers towards the islands. That's what's disrupting the trade wind flow that we'll have tomorrow for Aloha Friday and become more southeasterly as we get into the weekend. But good news is we have a new high pressure system that will build as we step into the new week and that's going to bring some northeasterly winds back towards the islands. So the trade winds will return, but even in a cooler and a crisper fashion with some of that Arctic chill being brought down from the north. But as mentioned, the showers, we see more pockets of moisture moving through. So if anything, it's isolated up to scattered showers, but nothing really extravagant. There's really a very stable atmosphere over the island. So whatever showers do come through should be quick passing. 85 degrees looks to be the high coming in tomorrow. Partly cloudy skies. Most of the cloud buildup looks to remain towards the east. In terms of those winds, as mentioned, we're going to see those light winds, which can pose a little uh, discomfort for the fire work smoke come New Year's Eve and even New Year's Day, but cooler conditions again with the return of those trade winds and those dry conditions, they look to continue all the way into 2023. Dash, back to you.